Hi, I'm in the midst of preparing for a time management workshop. I thought I wanted to share with you a complete pictures how to manage your time. And uh, one of the things is to really understand and uh, to list out things you need to do and making sure you know which one go first, which one go later. And uh, that is really, really important. And uh, of course, as you know that managing time is vital to the success of anyone. And what the reason that stopping us, you know, uh, barriers of to action it is about procrastinations. Why people procrastinate? I do. I'm not sure whether you do or not. And so one other way is to really nail it down what action you need to take. That makes a difference. And uh, the way to find out is to have that time lock. Uh, to be really sure, you know, generally, you know, what goes through your day, what kind of things that you do, and you got to be aware of it. Without awareing of the tasks that you do every day, you can't really manage your time. And one of the other things that I share in this time management workshop is time boxing. Time boxing, not time boxing. Time boxing used by famous celebrity like Elon Musk, box your time. And uh, for instance, that you want to finish a task, checking your email within one hour, box your time. So one, when one hour is up, stop it and check whether you have, have you completed it or you have completed it before one hour. Yeah, so time boxing is really, really helpful. And uh, setting smart goals, a classic uh, goal setting exercise, but I thought it's still very useful to set a smart goals. It make it specific, make it measurable, attainable, relevant, and time frame or time bound. And set such a goal will really help you to focus on that. Yeah, setting smart goals. And the four quadrants, Stephen Covey, raining, never run out of seasons. Uh, quadrant one, two, three, and four. Uh, Often time we overlook again and again, even though that I myself being aware of it, the quadrant of not urgent but important, such as your health, exercising, reading, upscaling. Uh, these are the area that is not urgent but important. Spend more time in that quadrant too, that it can really help you to get better. And uh, you know, get it done. Get it done means being aware of what's on your desk, what's in your mind. Download it, get it done. And uh, one of the things that one of my favorite is uh, knowing your time. When is your prime time? I'm a morning person, so my prime time will run from uh, probably from 8 to 11 a.m. And my downtime will be at 10 p.m. onwards. So do your most complex task during your prime time. Yeah, so then you check your energy. 80-20 principle has always been my favorite and uh, bring Richard Koch's work of 80-20 and uh, to really understand, you know, what are the little things that I could do today that make a big impact in my life or impact in the life of others. Doing video like this, you know, one recording, it can be played again and again and when people need reference, I say, hey, go check out this video about time management. Yeah, so that will be some of the key uh, areas or key tools to help you to have a complete picture of time management. Give it a try and I'm sure that it will help you to improve the way you manage your time, productivity and eventually, you know what, time is life, your life.